Hello viewers, this is Just Pregnant Work TV, a place where you can get the latest information about Nigerian news and all the news in details. Those alive after Buhari's regime deserves certificate of survivor, says Dino Malayi. This guy is always funny. You know, most of his utterances is always funny. You know, let's go further. I said Senator Dino Malayi, who represented the Kogi West Senatorial District during the Hate National Assembly, has said Nigerians who remain alive. After President Muhammad Buhari's tenor should be issued a certificate for survivor. Daily Post reports that the president has been under verbal attack since Tuesday, Tuesday over his comment threatening to deal with some elements in southwest, in southeast, for allegedly attacking security operatives and government facilities in the region. Buhari, while receiving briefing from the Independence National Electoral Commission (INEC). Chairman on the recent destructions of the commission properties in the South he said those behind the attack will soon receive the shock of their lives. Many concerned Nigerians have reprimanded the president for allegedly threatening the launch genocide attacks against the people of Southeast. Following the outrage by Nigerians who took to their social media handle to lambast the president over the alleged threat, Twitter deleted the president controversial tweet. In his own reactions, the former lawmaker citing the numerous challenges currently bed evening the entire nation, said Nigerians who survived the current administration should be greeted with happy survivor. He made the remark on Wednesday via a post on his verified Facebook page. The post read, While I truly speaking after Buhari's eight years reign, of terror and death, Nigerians that are still alive deserve a national certificate of survival. Greetings then will be happy survivor. A AKU great Baka da survivor in the survivor SDM. Wow, so viewers, what do you think about this? What is your own take? About why uh, Dino Melay said, you know, this guy is just always like something else, you know. You know, they said, hold idiots, food tubes are not part of the people that spoil this country. You idiots, criminal, God punish you, entire generation. You know, they said, at least thank God you know that the country is spoiled. And thanks to your grand patron, Buhari, who made it worse. I knew as a average nautilus, you cannot stand by the truth, no matter what. Just be enjoying your hardship and smiling. And that should Nigeria separate and the north becomes a country, and Buhari happens to be their president, this nonsense insulting people for Buhari's sake will kill Buhari in less than a week for bad governance, I tell you the truth, which is true, very, very, very correct. You know, the fact is that even certificate is not even enough for them. Those who survived this anistic government should be awarded gold medals for doing the impossible, because <laughs> should be awarded for, for even killing our people self. I'm telling you the truth. This is crazy. This is crazy. May God help us. You know, someone said that Buhari is an AK-47 with an uncountable round of ammunitions in the hands of Dima, the resident, the resident in the north. He said, Mr. Jester, you are not far from the truth, but there may be no Nigerian by that time, which is God, good news in fact. Were you not among those who said... That he was the best man for the job. And now look at what Dino Melaye was talking about. When he was still in the position. He is one of the people that actually supported President Muhammad Buhari. And now, you know, castigating him now is not the best option for him. This politics thing is just crazy. It's just crazy. But that was all of all that was what all of them, including Dino Melaye, brought into the government of Nigeria. At least Dino Melaye is one of the people that actually supported President Muhammad Buhari becoming the president of Nigeria. So what are we now saying? And now he's now going against him. And an evil man to lead a country like Nigeria. Huh. It, 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 God, God will not forgive all of them. All of them that supported is is leading the country. God will not forgive them. A tribalistic man being a president of a country is evil. It's even dangerous to us. It's dangerous to us. And that is the reason why we are still suffering from it today. Hmm. You know, someone said from his statement, that means he is one behind the killings. 
which is going on every day in Benue State because of autumn refusal of Ruga and open grazing, and now equipped his people with AK-47 and others against the people of Benue. Believe it or not, take it. Is one of the people that actually affect that that is destroying destroying the country right now. So now he's coming out to to speak against President Muhammad Buhari. When all of them gather together to destroy the country. This is crazy. So guys, what is your own take about this? What do you think about the utterances of uh, Dino Milaye? Are you really support of it? And kindly drop your comments at the comment section below. We appreciate you all for all, all your efforts for dropping your comments. And also please don't forget to press the notification button. So that whenever you upload news, you will always be the first person to watch our latest news anytime, any, any day. And also please press the subscription button also. We appreciate you all. We appreciate you all. We say God bless you to you. Always stay safe at this crucial time. It's very important to you and me. I will love you there once again. Bye.